business. <laughs> Usually for service-based businesses, the best way to grow is through referrals and word of mouth and yeah. connections. Wow, that's a lot of work. That's a lifetime of work. Welcome to another morning show. I'm excited to be here with a new friend, Nikisha. Yes. Welcome aboard. Thank you, thank you. you. I'm a co-owner co of a company called Beyond Services Choice Matters. And what I do, I specialize in customized service for families with individuals with disabilities. So um, basically, I cater to your needs. So where, what, what is your pain point? What, what's your stressful ear? Where do you need me the most? And that's where I come in. Awesome. So how can I help? So, <laughs> one of the biggest biggest um, help that I think I need the most is, um, because my business is fairly new, I just launched it in January, um, I want to be more vi um, visibility within the social media. Right now, my business is striving from word of mouth, yeah. which is awesome, but to take it to the next level, I need to be able to, you know, market more, so... I'll so do, so we were talking quickly, you know, before you got here early. I love it. <laughs> always show up early, guys. <laughs> always show up early. So you're a service-based business, mm -hmm. and, and you're very geographic dependent. Yeah, GTA. Right, so like Toronto area. Yeah. Usually for service-based businesses, the best way to grow is through referrals and word of mouth and yeah. connections, as opposed to going and blasting online. You mm -hmm. can, but the challenge with it is, you know, Hello, everybody. You know, Hi. I, we've got people watching in and tuning in, but they're all Thank over the world. Thank you guys for joining. They're all over the world, right? <laughs> oh, nice. Because my audience yeah. is global. Global, yes. Because what I do is not specific to a city. Mm -hmm. I think the best thing in the short term is to start partnering up with every agency, with mm -hmm. every government program, with every, like having you speak at local events. Um, I think you get a lot more leverage next week i i have a trade show at a health and wellness organization and i'm going to be speaking there as well so that's my speaking career is something that i'm developing as well right um one of the challenges is to get to get to the agencies what i'm currently doing is sending out mails but i'm trying to figure a way to target the agencies more right to get referral through the agency how many clients do you have now seven. we have about seven so for each, so you've got seven clients. Mm -hmm. They've been in the system for a while. Oh, yes. Right? Yes, yes, yes. For, for Most of them from birth. So, and, and they're so all the, adults. Like, they're all adults. All now. adults. So like two um, decades have been in the system. I think they're anywhere between age 27 to 48. To 48? Yes. Wow. <laughs> wow. That's a lot of work. That's a lifetime of work. It's crazy. Yeah. Anyway, um, what I'd be doing is asking, you, you form a, a close friendship with the family. Yes, yes, yes. Right? Like, you're now part of their family. Yes. Your extended family. Yes. <laughs> Aunt, Aunt <laughs> Nikisha. Um, what I would do is ask them, what are all the agencies, agencies that they've used mm -hmm. over their oh, okay. span and ask for an introduction. To those. Okay, that's I'm good trying to advice. grow my business. Yes. I'm trying to get into more agencies. Mm -hmm. Who have you used? Okay. Because they've used multiple. Other, multiples, yes, tons. yes, yes, yes. Especially for someone who, a uh, family with individual disability, you depend on ages, you depend on support, because that's the right. only way to really um, function. You can't really function on your own. You need other sources to come in to help you. So, right? so this so, person you're working with is 48. Yes. How many agencies have they used? I'm not sure. Because right now they're currently living at an agency. They're with, living at an they, agency. They're living with an organization, okay. within an organization. Okay. So I go in within that organization because they're not able to, because of shortage of staffing, they're not able to support this individual right. in the way that the parents want them to be supported. So I go into the agency and I work with the individual directly, one on one. Right. I think you can build a million dollar business without ever having to post on social media. Oh, wow. That's good to know, because <laughs> that, that part is like, because the, the problem that I'm having with social media is to find that time to do it, right? Because there's so much, because most of my day's out, and then when I'm home, then I'm home with the family and, you know, and trying to do paperwork and sending out emails, because I have to send out emails to family, like, you know. Yeah, I mean, and, it's just making, like making it a priority, just like everything else. Mm -hmm. Like, how do you find time for your kids? Or how yeah. do you find time for your husband? How do you find time for... You make the time, you put in your yeah. calendar. How do I yeah. have time? Yeah. You know, like, yeah. I don't. 
I think for you, it's helpful to have a presence、mm-hmm. in that. And I'm happy to go. I love social media. I'm、yeah. happy to go all day. We could talk all day long about social media strategies. And no problem. I just don't know that it serves you. It probably won't serve to、me. get、yeah. you where you need to go. Considering it's a service-based business、mm-hmm. and it's local. Yes.、Um, what I would do is, if I'm looking at my main social platforms, I would have some. I would make sure I have a great、um, picture. Mm-hmm. Whether it's your face or whether it's your organization, logo, yeah, something. I have, I'd really fix my bio so it looks、mm-hmm. explains exactly what I do, and then I would have a few pieces of content that that reflect、what、you and your、do. thought leadership、yeah. really well. Not even just like here's what we do, but your approach,、mm-hmm. like what makes you so different from、mm-hmm. all the other agencies or PSWs that are going in to work with these people. Okay. Right, and so your. Your approach and why it's different, why you're special.、Mm-hmm. Not here's why you should hire us. And that's what's working because usually when we go into when family when families seek us is because they are desperate for like the current families that we have right now they're desperate for support. And the good thing about us we're not traditional, right? We offer something different from what the traditional service offers. So、okay. we're not like this is what we offer. You got to buy into this. We come in and it's like okay, where do you need us? And we customize our service based on the families, right? So that's the unique. So family kind of like that because we're here. We listen, like, okay. So what do you want?、Right. Where do you need us?、Mm-hmm. You know, wh- what's your child? So it could be behavior, right? And a lot of times. How did you get your first seven? To refer. From、yeah. agencies.、Um, Friends. So one was an individual that I know、uh, I worked with with the the agency that I used to work with.、Um, the others are through people referring us, and refer yeah. So just chat it of refer referral, yeah. So yeah, all of them is through referral. Right now, that, and and it's great. We're we're busy five days a week, which is great. Yeah. So the next level is to get to that stage where we could start hiring now, right?、Um, and just grow the business. You could be a million dollar business、yeah. next year just、yes. through referrals. Yes. Which is crazy for a startup. Yeah. <laughs> But it's all government yeah. funded. Yeah, it's all government funded, which so, is great. It's easy、um, for the family because. It's not. It's not, not money coming、anything. out of pocket. It's、right. money, and and the good thing about them, they need to use up this funding within the year in, or they lose it. Right. Right. So it's not like they get this funding and they got to pocket it. They get this funding to use for service like me. And then they can use it every year. Every year, it's automatic. So,、oh, so, it's automatic. Yeah, automatically、oh, they get、okay. it every year. It's such an easy business. <laughs> it's the best business. <laughs> here's here's twenty thousand dollars every year to spend. Go. <laughs> Nothing out of your pocket. So it's just to find those family. One other thing that I was thinking to do was to. But you're not competing with the agencies. No, I'm not competing with any agencies. Because the agencies funding make their own、separate. funding. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not competing with anyone, and I'm filling in the gap. So I'm not even competing with service. So what what we're doing, we're giving additional service on top of what you have. You just need to、right? talk to every agency. Yes. So it's to get it's to get it's to get it, and that that that's what we're trying to figure out how to get. In those doors of the agencies, so that's why we're thinking. Okay, maybe if we go on, like I was even thinking, like、um, upgrading my social media present and target those agencies, like the directors and stuff, and start bonding with, with them. It's just to get through, because it, it's, it's one thing to send mails or send email because you have the receptionist that yeah, yeah. weed out and throw away your stuff, right? So how do I get to those targeted people that will listen and can make those decisions? Yeah.、Right? So so if I'm you, I start with. What I said, which is、mm-hmm. through all your connections、yes. and then all of your clients asking them for introductions, because、okay. I'm sure they would say yes.、Mm-hmm. What agencies have you worked with, and would you mind making an introduction to the person that person. you connected、okay. with? Okay, the, that's I mean, a good one. Thank you. They would do it. Yeah, they will do it. But, and then, then for every new、yeah. client that you onboard, you would do the same. Do, thing. Same thing. Yeah, and then it just. Mm-hmm. It spreads. Yeah. So you've already got seven people. They've already worked with five agencies. Oh yes. At least. At least. Right. Okay.、Yeah. So ten. And、agencies. some of them are still working with at least five agencies. Okay. But if they've worked、yeah. with if they've worked with ten agencies each,、yeah. that's seventy introductions.、Yeah. And then what we find a、that's、lot of times,、like, yeah, you're done. You're done. Yeah. Just getting on the we, just just following up and connecting with seventy、mm-hmm. people. There's a lot it. of work,、it's、and then going to meet them、yeah. and and we can just find the time, and that's it. It's just to get that. This is such an easy business. I love it. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> but you're done. Like, you, you don't need to overthink it. Yeah. Because the, the next thing I would say is, okay, yes, what you could do is on social, if you're looking at Instagram, for example, I would make sure that I had nine really good pieces of content mm -hmm. that you post once, like post before the end of the year, that really represent your brand, so that if somebody came to your your page, they could see they'd say, oh, oh, this is what they do. Mm -hmm. They sound like they're experts. Yeah. They, they look reputable. I, I'm mm -hmm. curious. It's not just some yeah. random post. And that's, up, right? that's a challenge because we don't want to just put random posts. We wanted to do posts that represent what we do. So right? I would have, but I would just do nine. I would just do nine on Instagram. I would probably delete all the old ones that you're not proud of. Mm -hmm. I just have nine. And then I wouldn't worry about a, a posting strategy. Mm -hmm. I would be targeted following all of the agencies in Toronto mm -hmm. or in your area. And we, know, we are aware of all the agencies. Well, most posting. of them, not all, but most of them. And then comment. Yeah. On their, comment on their stuff. Oh, okay. That's so a that, good one too, yeah. So then when they see it, mm -hmm. they'll say, oh, who's this mm -hmm. company or who's this person? They click on your account and then they go to your account and they see oh, your okay. nine posts. Oh, okay. That's a good one. Yeah, right? yeah, so, so you're like on their radar. Strategy. Like, oh, okay, yeah. these guys are interesting. Yeah, yeah. Right? But I don't think you even need to do that. And, and that's a good thing to know because we know we have a good thing going on and we see the potential and we see how much we've grown. You know, I was talking to my business partner and we were like, oh my goodness, how many business within the first year does this well? Like for a lot of people, they think seven clients, that's not much. But for right. us, it's a lot because you're looking at the, the amount of funding of money, right? that they're paying. Yeah, right. they're paying. So, so what we make within the first year is like, a lot of business don't make that within five years, right? right? So it's like, wow, if we market it properly and we target the right people, it, you know, it... And it's ongoing. And it's ongoing. Forever. Because, yeah, it's forever on, as, long as, as long as they need us, right? <laughs> it's ongoing forever because they need you forever. Because yeah. if you start working with somebody at 20... Yes, and, and they need us... Until they're yeah. 50. Yeah, yeah. You'll be retired before they stop needing you. <laughs> yeah. I know it's a good business. It's a crazy business. <laughs> and the good thing about it, we offer we offer a wide range of service because we, we we have the mental piece, we have the behavioral piece, we have the parental piece that we offer, we have the training piece that we offer, you know, and we bring our service to you. You don't have to come to us. Yeah, I mean now, right. and then as you grow, it can't just be you and your partner. You have yeah, to hire people. Yeah, we're hiring and, people. But you're still making good margin yes. off of hiring people. Yes. Once you grow to a certain size, it'll just be your reputation. So your business now is a very short-term marketing effort mm -hmm. because you could get to, you know, 100 to 150 in revenue and you and your partner manage everything. Yes. Are off, like, seeing all the, all the patients or yeah. clients or whatever you're calling them. Um, and checking in and could we, yeah, yeah. we have to still be involved. But you'll to be make stretched, sure. but yes. it's like you guys, the two of you can handle everything yourself in that range. Mm -hmm. And so to get to 150 in revenue is just that. It's just yeah. tapping everybody you know and asking all your clients, can you we could get Yeah, if we, like, you yeah. You could be there in early 2019. It, like, within January, February. Yeah, yeah, easy. yeah. Yeah, easy. Beyond that, though, then the marketing starts to snowball itself. Mm -hmm. And you won't have to worry as much about the marketing. Yeah. It'll still just be, who do you know? Yeah. Um, and but it's just to do the groundwork now. Then it, then that becomes easy. Yeah. Then the real problem to scale the business to the million plus is going to be uh, operations. Mm -hmm. Is going to be hiring. Mm -hmm. It's going to be building a team. Yes. That's yes. going to be the entire company. And that's company. the goal. That's, that's the goal. The, that's, the enti that's the entire problem to solve. Mm -hmm. As you scale, can I get people who represent my brand? And we could even, we're, we're able to go into the school as well, right? We could hire staff to go into school board to work as well. Oh, but you don't have yeah. a, you don't have a, you won't have mm -hmm. a marketing problem. Mm -hmm. You'll get too many clients. Yeah. The, the, the only marketing problem you'll ever have is if your name gets tarnished because yeah. you're putting the wrong people, people in yeah. and then you stop getting referrals. Mm -hmm. If you just follow that process of every time you bring somebody new in, you know, you've had some good results, a month later you'll, mm -hmm. you'll ask them, hey, would you mind referring us? Like, and as you build momentum mm -hmm. and more reputation and more trust, the referral tap just turns on even more. More, yes. Where, where yes. you won't have to even worry about it. It's just mm -hmm. going to come in, which is awesome because yeah. you're doing good work in the community. Yes. Right? As long as you keep doing good work, you'll just get more and more, more referrals, more. which is a, most people have a marketing problem. Beyond this next three months, you won't. Yeah. If you do a good job, like if you follow up with, if you got seventy referrals, you wouldn't even have the time.
before Christmas to meet everybody so and have coffee, yeah. And, yeah. right? So you, I like that. If you want to learn nine effective ways to grow your business, check out the video right there next to me. I think you'll enjoy it. Continue to believe and I'll see you there. What are some of the benefits of being small that a business owner can leverage to beat out the big guys? I think the big thing about being small is that you're nimble, that you're flexible.